Well, we got him out. Finally. I'll show you what's going on here. All right, we finally got her 87 mesh tan out of the barn. It's springtime. Got some parts to go on him, fix him up, get him ready to drive again. Might not be able to tell it on camera, but that hill's pretty steep where that come out there. If the truck was running, it wouldn't come out of there by itself. I've got it on my many times. We'll give you a good walk around view of it before the beforehand view, I guess. Bed's in good shape. I ain't gonna have to worry about that. I know it red there looks like rust, but it ain't. It's paint. It used to be red. Thought I would like it lowered, so I lowered it. Don't like it. I lowered it five inches all the way around. I don't like it lowered. I'm gonna raise it back up. Got a cab to put on it because this one's shot. All the mounts is rusted through on it. That's the reason why I quit driving it because you go around the curve and the cab would try to raise up and turn off on you. But I've had the truck since I was 16 year old. It, I guess it's about time for me to do a little work to it. It's 87. I don't know if I told you before or not. Been sitting in the barn all winter. I figured I'd better down there to keep it out of the snow and out of the weather than it was to. Let it set outside in the weather. Seems to help. I'll show you the reason why I'm changing the cab here. All that pillar's rotted out and the rocker panel. I don't know how good this is gonna work underneath. That's the frame. Yeah. There we go. All that. Look at that, huh? Yeah. Pretty raw. Pretty raunchy. And then inside. Yeah. Look at that, I just discovered another hole. But when 
whenever we get ready to tear this one down, I'll do a video on it and show you what we're going to do with it. So, and as always, thanks for watching. I sure appreciate that. Thank goodness spring's here. I've been waiting for it.